Hi friends, how are you? By blessings to God, you are doing well. So this is Dr. Arthur Jena, faculty member, PG Department of Business Management, as well as the coordinator, PG Department of Commerce, Fakir Mohan University, Basavir, Balasur, Odisha. Friends, once again, I am welcoming to all of you to your channel, to my channel, Dr. A.P. Jena Classes. Friends, as I am discussing current the 75 vital MCQs, uh, I have prepared this, uh, these 75 MCQs as for the prescribed syllabus of UGC net for the subject of commerce. So, friends, as the discussion be both, both useful and interesting, uh, particularly the students who are going to appear the semester exemption, I mean, that is a BBA. MBA, BCom, MCom. So friends, so as a discussion uh, hey, uh, business environment and international business. So that's why. So as a discussion be both both useful and interesting. How particularly those who are uh, preparing for the lectureship exemption. I mean that is the PGT, SSB, and other university level exemption. So as a discussion be both both useful and fruitful. How for the particularly for the uh, PhD and the PG entrance exam. So friends, so uh, during the discussion, if any mismatch or gap, you will find kindly you give your available comment and suggestion in the comment section. So uh, friends, so uh, to me, so it's a, uh, the vital uh, all are, I mean the 75 MCQs are the very, very vital. So far as the uh, net exemption is concerned, so before discussion, uh, I am wishing all the very, very best, not only for your net exemption, but also for the other uh, related exemptions. So, friends, without delay, ask a discussion, Suru Hojai, Kya Bate. So, I am again requesting to all of you uh, from beginning till end, kindly you watch it and definitely I am Bada Kartam, Bada Detahun, that you will enjoy here and definitely you will get uh, the value. Um, by giving your time so friends so let's discuss one by one 75 mcq so friends it's the part 11 so i have already posted the 10, 10 parts kindly go through the uh, playlist so our first mcq is international rules and regulations for international trade or business are usually framed by whom whether a it's the wto uh, so, World Trade Organization, its establishment year is 1995, whether it's the Asian Development Bank, or Matlab, that is the ADP, so its establishment year is 1966, then the International Monetary Fund, so its establishment year is 1944, then, so Exim Bank, so friends, Exim Bank's Matlab, it's the Export and Import Bank, its establishment year, Hey, 1982. Select the right options from the following as given below. Whether A, first and third only, B, it's second and third only, C, it's the first and second only, D, it's third and fourth only. Friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. Matlab, WTO and ADB. So they usually frame the rules and regulations for the international business or international trade. So friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. I have friends some chacha going, what is the meaning of international business? So international business refers to the trade of goods, services, technology, capital and or knowledge across national borders at a global or the transactional scale. So it's the meaning of a international business. So next one MCGOM the which are the factors influencing the international trade or a business. So these are the factors exchange rate, culture is there, consumer demand, export import policy, FDI policy, then the inflation rate. So FDI stands um, friends it stands for foreign direct investment and inflation so friends so it's the general tendency that is the increasing the prices of essential products so select the right option from the following as given below whether a all the above except is two b a it's all the above except three c it's all the above except four d it's all the above so friends so a is the right option for this mcq matlab so culture is not a influencing factor for the international trade or business so uh, all the above except two so friends so a is the right option for this mcq 
सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे लाइसेंस फेयर पॉलिसी इज एडॉप्टेड इन हुई सिस्टम वदर इट्स ए इज ए कैपिटलिस्ट इकोनॉमिक सिस्टम बी इट्स ए सोशलिस्ट इकोनॉमिक सिस्टम सी इट्स द कम्युनिस्ट इकोनॉमिक सिस्टम डी इट्स द मिस्ड इकोनॉमिक सिस्टम सो फ्रेंड्स सो बी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एमसीक्यू आइए फ्रेंड्स हम चर्चा करें व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ दैट इज लाइसेंस फेयर सो इट्स ए एंड इकोनॉमिक फिलोसफी डेवलप्ड इन द 18th सेंचुरी दैट अपोजेस एनी गवर्नमेंट इंटरवेंशन इन बिजनेस अफेयर्स इट्स द मीनिंग ऑफ लाइसेंस फेयर सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे माइक्रो बीज माइक्रो एनवायरमेंटल फैक्टर्स ऑफ ए बिजनेस फार्म सर गिवन बिलो सो दीज आर व्हाट इज दिस इंटरमीडिएटरीज टेक्नोलॉजी सप्लायर्स कस्टमर्स सो सिलेक्ट द राइट ऑप्शंस फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग्स सो ए फर्स्ट सेकंड फोर्थ ओनली बी इट्स द फर्स्ट थर्ड फोर्थ ओनली सी इट्स द सेकंड थर्ड फोर्थ ओनली डी इट्स द फर्स्ट सेकंड थर्ड ओनली सो फ्रेंड्स सो ए इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एमसीक्यू मतलब ए होगा देन बी होगा देन फोर्थ भी होगा सो इट्स द माइक्रो बिजनेस एनवायरमेंटल फैक्टर्स सो टेक्नोलॉजी इट्स ए दैट इज द एक्सटर्नल और द माइक्रो बिजनेस एनवायरमेंट सो फ्रेंड्स इन सेपरेट वीडियो विल डिस्कस इन डिटेल अबाउट द माइक्रो मतलब द एक्सटर्नल माइक्रो मतलब द इंटरनल बिजनेस फैक्टर्स सो फ्रेंड्स यूर ए इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एन सी क्यू सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे सम सोशल एनवायरमेंट ऑफ ए बिजनेस आर गिवेन बिलो so so these are the social environment uh, social environmental factors whether a so these are so first one essence of innovation then values then customs and traditions um, fourth it's a culture and a social needs so select the right option from the following so whether a it's the first second third only b it's the first third fourth only c it's the second third fourth only d it's all the above friends so c is the right option for this mcq so here uh, matlab the values customs and traditions and culture and social needs are the social environmental factors so they will influence the business so ye matlab so essence of innovation will not be the social environmental factors so friends so see is the right option for this mcq so next one hum dekhenge द वाइटल एम से क्यू द इनकम एंड एक्सपेंडिचर पॉलिसी ऑफ द गवर्नमेंट इज नोन एज और कॉल्ड एज क्या है वदर इट्स द एक्सपोर्ट इम्पोर्ट पॉलिसी बी इट्स द फिजिकल पॉलिसी सी इट्स द मॉनिटरी पॉलिसी डी इट्स द इंडस्ट्रियल पॉलिसी फ्रेंड्स सो बी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एम सी क्यू सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे द प्रोडक्ट लाइफ साइकिल थियोरी हैज बीन प्रोपाउंडेड बाई होम वदर ए इट्स द रेमंड बर्नम इट्स द एडम स्मिथ सी माइकल पटर डी एस सी दैविड रिकार्डो फ्रेंड्स सो ए इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एम सी क्यू मतलब रेम बर्न हैज डेवलप्ड द प्रोडक्ट लाइफ साइकिल थियोरी सो ए इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एम सी क्यू सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे हुई चार द ऑब्जेक्ट इज ऑफ ग्लोबलाइजेशन ए इट्स अ लिबरलाइजेशन ऑफ इम्पोर्ट बी सेकेंड इट्स रिफॉर्म्स ऑफ फॉर एन एक्सचेंज देन प्रमोशन ऑफ एक्सपोर्ट देन इट्स एनहांसमेंट ऑफ इंटरनेशनल ट्रेड बिटवीन द कंट्रीज सो सिलेक्ट द राइट ऑप्शन फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग्स वेदर ए इट्स अ फर्स्ट सेकेंड थर्ड ओनली बी इट्स द सेकेंड थर्ड फोर्थ ओनली सी इट्स द सेकेंड थर्ड फोर्थ ओनली डी इट्स ऑल द अबर फ्रेंड्स सो डी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एम सी क्यू मतलब फर्स्ट सेकेंड थर्ड फोर्थ सो दीज आर द ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ ग्लोबलाइजेशन आई ए फ्रेंड्स हम चर्चा करेंगे व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ ग्लोबलाइजेशन सो ग्लोबलाइजेशन रेफर्स द इंटीग्रेशन द मार्केट्स इन द ग्लोबल इकोनॉमी सो फ्रेंड्स सो ड्यूरिंग आवर डिस्कशन विल ऑल्सो डिस्कस द इम्पोर्टेंट कॉन्सेप्ट एंड मीनिंग सो काइंडली स्टे विथ मी फ्रॉम बिगनिंग से टिल एंड तक सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे विच आर द मेन गोल्स और ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ आई एम एफ सो आई एम एफ इज सिचुएटेड इन वाशिंगटन डी सी सो फर्स्ट टू इन्श्योर द स्टेबिलिटी इन द इंटरनेशनल मॉनिटर सिस्टम बी इट्स टू फैसिलिटेड द एक्सपेंशन एंड बैलेंसड ग्रोथ ऑफ इंटरनेशनल ट्रेड थर्ड टू डेवलप द मेकानिजम फॉर कोलाबरेसन एंड 
on international monetary issues say sorry let's say and international then uh, fourth one to sorry provide to provide loans and advances to private sector undertakings fifth one to increase the productivity then sixth one is to have the job creation and economic wealth be uh, friends select the right option from the following as given below a it's see all the above except second b it's all the above second uh, except four c it's all the above except fifth d it's see all the above so friends so b is the right option for this mc q so fourth one will not be the main goal of the imc so next one mcq beti bachao beti padhao jojana started by the government in of india comes under which environment whether it's a micro environment b it's the political environment c it's the economic environment d it's the social environment friends so b is the right option for this mcq so beti bachao beti padhao jojana started by the government comes under the political environment so b is the right option for this mcq so next one a type of import duty on importing of goods on the basis of a value of goods imported or proposed to be imported from a country it's a call or is known as kya hai whether it's a custom duty based the specific duty so it's the ad valorem duty d is the import duty friends so c is the right option for this mc q so next one i'm looking at the dimensions of business environment are given below what are the dimensions so friends you have to remember that is the legal environment uh, economic environment social environment political environment technological environment select the right options from the following whether a first second third fourth only b is the second third fourth fifth only c is the second third fourth fifth only d is the all the above friends so d is the right option for this mc q so these are the dimensions so business environment economic environment technological environment social environment political environment the legal environment so friends so you have to remember this so easily you can remember that is p e s t l e so it is that is the p stands for political environment e stands for economic environment s stands for that is the uh, it is social environment then uh, t stands for that is the technological environment and l e it is stands for the legal environment so you have to friends remember that is the pistol so business environment kya hai friends i am charcha karenge so be -E, be -E, it's the business environment is the, the sum total of all external and internal factors that influence a business so external and internal factors of so external it's the macro business environment internal it's known as that is the micro business environment so friends in separate video we will discuss in detail about the dimensions of a business environment so next one which is or which are the type or types of democracy democracy associated with the idea of a globalization whether it's the metro uh, politan democracy then global democracy see it's a, that is the participative democracy uh, fourth one is the social democracy so select the right option from the following a it's the one one only b it's the first and second only c it's the second and fourth only d it's the all the above so friends a is the right option for this mc cube matlab so so metropolitan democracy is associated with the idea of globalization so friends so a is the right option for this mcq so next one hum dekhenge consider the accession and the region as given below so a it's the primary capital and the secondary capital market are integrated with the world economy so r is the it's the uh, globalization integrates the domestic economy with the world economy options are whether a is right only 
बी इट्स आर इज राइट ओनली सी इट्स बोथ ए एंड आर आर राइट बट आर इज नॉट द करेक्ट एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ ए डी इट्स बोथ ए एंड आर आर राइट बट आर इज द करेक्ट एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ ए फ्रेंड्स सो ए सॉरी सी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एम सी क्यू बोथ एसेसन एंड द रिजन आर राइट बट आर इज नॉट द करेक्ट एक्सप्लेनेशन of a so friends so c is the right option for this mcq i a from this image so michael potter has coined or developed the that is the potter's five force model so yeah hey whether it's the competition in the industry second is the power of suppliers say third one it's the power of customer fourth one is the potential of new entrants into the industry Fifth one is the threat of substitute products. Sixth one is the complementary products. So select the right options from the following: A, all the above except four. B, it's all the above except five. C, it's all the above except six. D, it's all the above. Friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. Means the complementary products are not the forces in the Potter five forces model. So friends, you have to remember. So I am just saying that the Potter's five force model help to strategist understand what makes an industry profitable and provides the insights needed to make the strategic choices. So it's the meaning or the concept of that is the Potter's five force model. सो नेक्स्ट पॉइंट हम देखेंगे द की फीचर्स ऑफ डिमोनिटाइजेशन आर गिवन बिलो ए इट्स द डेवलपमेंट ऑफ लेस गैस इकोनॉमी सेकंड वन इट्स चैनलाइजिंग सेविंग्स इनटू द फॉर्मल फाइनेंशियल सिस्टम फोर्थ वन इट्स मेजरमेंट ऑफ टैक्स एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन फोर्थ वन इज मेजरमेंट टू अबाउट द टैक्स इवा जोन सिलेक्ट द राइट ऑप्शंस फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग ए इट्स फर्स्ट सेकंड थर्ड ओनली बी इट्स द फर्स्ट थर्ड फोर्थ ओनली सी इट्स द सेकंड थर्ड Fourth only D is all the above, friends. So D is the right option for this MC. Okay, the key features of demonetization are um, first, second, third, as well as fourth will be there. So D is the right option for this MC. Okay, so next one we will see an international agreements made between importers and exporters of different countries to buy and sell a certain volume of goods. At an agreed price, it's known as क्या है whether it's a unilateral agreement, B it's that is the bilateral agreement, C it's the multilateral agreement, and D it's the international agreement. Friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. You have to remember. So next one, we will see which statements are correct towards the financial sector reforms. So first statement, statement one. Financial sector reforms are related to insurance sector. Second, financial sector reforms are related to banking sector. Third, financial sector reforms are related to forex market. Forex market, friends, so it's the foreign exchange market. Fourth one, statement promotion of financial inclusion. Then protection of confidence in the financial system. Sixth one, ensuring the financial stability. Select the right options from the following. A all the above except four. B it's all the above except five. C it's all the above except six. D it's all the above. Friends, so D is the right option for this MCQ. मतलब first, second, third, fourth, five, six. All statements are correct towards the financial sector reforms. Are you friends? हम चर्चा करेंगे. What is the objectives? of a financial sector reforms the objective of financial sec uh, sector reforms is to set up an efficient financial system which will improve the allocative efficiency of resources promote the financial inclusion protect the confidence in the financial system and ensure the financial stability that is the uh, objective of uh, the financial sector reforms so next one hum dekhenge uh withdrawal by a state from an industry or sector fully or partially is called what whether it's the 
मॉडर्नाइजेशन बीट्स तो लिबरलाइजेशन सी तो प्राइवेटाइजेशन डी इट्स तो ग्लोबलाइजेशन नो डाउट फ्रेंड सो सी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एम सी क्यू वाइटल एम सी क्यू सो फ्रेंड्स इन सेमिस्टर एग्जाम्स ट्रू और फॉल्स और राइट वन और टू सेंटेंसेस एम सी क्यूज और फील इन द ब्लैक्स सो यू विल डेफिनेटली गेट सो दैट्स वाई दिज सेवेंटी फाइव एम सी क्यूज आर वेरी वेरी वाइटल सो फार एज द सेमिस्टर एग्जाम इज ए कंसर्न सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे सॉरी आइए हम चर्चा करें व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ लिबरलाइजेशन सो लिबरलाइजेशन रेफर्स टू द प्रोसेस ऑफ एलिमिनेटिंग द अननेसेसरी कंट्रोल्स एंड रेस्ट्रिक्शन फॉर द स्मूथ फंक्शनिंग ऑफ ट्रेड एंड बिजनेस ऑल ओवर द वर्ल्ड सो ग्लोबलाइजेशन रेफर्स टू द प्रोसेस बाय हुई आइडियाज गुड्स सर्विसेस आर स्प्रेड थ्रू आउट द वर्ल्ड बाय क्रॉसिंग द नेशनल बाउंड्रीज सो प्राइवेटाइजेशन फ्रेंड्स हियर वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस सो प्राइवेट प्राइवेटाइजेशन इट्स ए व्हाट इज द ट्रांसफर ऑफ ओनरशिप प्रॉपर्टी और बिजनेस फ्रॉम द गवर्नमेंट टू द प्राइवेट सेक्टर इज टर्म डैज इज टर्म डैज ग्लोबलाइजेशन सो इट्स ए फॉर I am recalling you LPG. So it's the LPG. It's the liberalisation. Friends, so P is that is the privatisation. G is the globalisation. So friends, you have to remember it's not the liquefied petroleum gas. So next one, I am going to see. Consider the micro environmental factors of a business which are given below. A is the uh, technological factors. B is the that is the Econo economic factors, C it's a uh, or third it's a political factors, fourth one it's a socio cultural factors. So select the right option from the following. So friends, we have already discussed, no doubt, friends. So all the above D is the right option for this MCQ. In dimensions of business environment, friends, we have already discussed the technological factors, मतलब technological environment, political factors, मतलब political environment, economic factors, मतलब फ्रेंड्स इट्स द इकोनॉमिक एनवायरनमेंट सोशियो कल्चरल कल्चरल फैक्टर मींस मींस इज सोशियो कल्चरल एनवायरनमेंट एंड अनदर दैट इज द डायमेंशन एनवायरनमेंट इट्स द लीगल एनवायरनमेंट सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे डैश रेफर्स टू द इन्वेस्टमेंट इन ए फॉरेन कंट्री व्हेयर द इन्वेस्टर्स रिटेन कंट्रोल ओवर द इन्वेस्टमेंट व्हेदर इट्स द एफ ए आई आई एस सो इट्स स्टैंड्स फॉर फ्रेंड्स फॉरेन इंस्टीट्यूशनल इन्वेस्टर्स सो In this serial, it's the typing error. B, it's the foreign direct investment (FDI). Then F, F, P, I, it's the foreign portfolio investment (D). It's the global investment. No doubt, friends. So B is the right option for this MCQ. मतलब F, D, I. दोबारा मैं repeat करता हूँ. FDI refers to the investment in a foreign country where the investors retain control over the investment. So next one, we will see. Uh, what are the types of uh, FDI? So normally, so these are the types or classification of uh, FDI: horizontal FDI, vertical FDI, then conglomerate FDI, then the platform FDI. No doubt, friends. So D is the right option for this MCQ. Friends, we have already discussed what is the meaning of FDI. Dobara, aye, hum chhoshe karenge. FDI the purchase of an interest of a country. Or company by an investor located in another country. It's the meaning of a. It's the meaning of a. A B D I I A friends. How to check? Can you get one by one? What is the meaning of horizontal merger? So sorry, horizontal A B D I. So horizontal A B D I involves the investing the capital in a foreign company which belongs to the same industry. Matlab related industry. हाँ सीमेंट इंडस्ट्री विथ द सीमेंट इंडस्ट्री दैट द इन्वेस्टर कंडक्ट्स और ओन्स द बिजनेस ऑपरेशन इन दे देन वर्टिकल एफ डे वेन एन एंटिटी इन्वेस्ट विद इन द सप्लाई चेन ऑफ ए बिजनेस बट द कंपोनेंट मे नॉट नेसेसरली बिलोंग टू द सेम इंडस्ट्री सो इट्स द ऑन रिलेटेड इन सप्लाई चेन देन कंग्लोमोरेट कंग्लोमोरेट एफ डी आई वेन एन इन्वेस्टर इन्वेस्ट इन Two entirely different businesses based on any com completely different industry. So it's the uh, total total industry unrelated as compared to the vertical in supply chain. 
so this will in supply chain there will be the vertical fdi then the platform fdi what is this uh, uh, platform fdi is the uh, final type of fdi the investors business works towards the expansion in a foreign country with the ultimate aim of exporting the products to a completely different third party it's the meaning of a platform fdi vital horizontal fdi vertical fdi conglomerate fdi and the platform fdi so next one hum dekhenge which are the parts of economic policy of a country from the following a industrial policy b matlab second export policy third it's the import policy fourth it's the monetary policy then fifth one matlab five it's the fiscal policy Sixth one is the structural policy. So uh, select the right options uh, from the following: A, it's a uh, all the above except four. B, it's all the above except five. C, it's all the above except six. D, it's all the above. Friends, right? so D is the right option for this MCQ. मतलब first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth. So D, these are the parts of the economic policy. of a country so next one hum dekhen consider the following external factors in a business environment of a business whether a it's a government a government regulation second is the competitors c it's a matlab third one inflation fourth it's a customer then the taxation then demographic factors so select the right options from the following a all the above except second only B is all the above except fourth only. C is all the above except sixth only. D is all the above. Friends, so D is the right option for this MCQ. First, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth. So they are the external factors of the business environment of a business, or they will influence the, or they will influence to the business. so next to anam hum dekhenge uh, which are the correct sequence of uh, the stages of uh, internationalization a is the uh, domestic international multinational global transactional b is the domestic international then multinational transaction global c is the domestic transactional international global and multinational d is the domestic transactional international multinational and global friends so a is the right option for this mcq so these are the matlab domestic international multinational global and transaction are the correct sequence the stages of uh, internationalization so a is the right option for this mcq so next year, next one i have uh, match karenge list 1 with list 2 Consider the following items and uh, and match list one with a list two, which are related to liberalisation of a agricultural trade. So list one, yeah, a auctionable subsidies, b is the non-auctionable subsidies, c is the prohibited subsidies, subsidies, d is the tariffication. So list two, first, replacement of existing non-tariff restrictions. Second, it's they have uh, demonstrably. adverse effects on other member countries third one it's towards the industrial resource in neglected regions fourth they act on goods which are contingent upon the export portion so select the right option from the following whether a a1 b2 c3 d4 then b it's a4 b3 c2 d1 C is A two, B three, C four, D one, D is A three, B two, C four, D one. Friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. मतलब A two, then B three, then C, then C four, then D one. so auctionable subsidies so they have a demonstrably adverse effect on other business then non auctionable subsidies towards the industrial resource in neglected regions then uh, provided subsidies so they act on goods 
which are contingent upon the export performance. Then tarification, it's a, the replacement of uh, existing non-tariff restriction. So C is the right option for this MC. Q, who has given the theory of uh, comparative cost advantages? Whether A is the Michael Potter, B is the David Ricardo, C Adam Smith, then D is the Henry Cater Adam. So friends, so B is the right option for this MCQ. I have friends, so about the so next MCQ based on the that is the uh, GAT. So here no doubt friends, so B will be the right option for this MCQ. Friends, we have already discussed, so establishment of W2A, Matlab World Trade Organization, establishment year is in 1995. Uh, the WTO was established to implement the final act of Uruguay, uh, round agreement of uh, Kiska, uh, it's the GATT. So GATT stands for, that is the General Agreement on Tariffs and Trade. So its establishment year is, that is 1947. Then, TRIPS is there, its establishment year is, that is 1995. So friends, so you have to remember the full form of or TRIPS stands for what? Then IRD, IRDP, so it stands for, uh, that is the International Reconstruction and Development Bank establishment year is, that is 1944. Then UNO, its establishment year is, that is 1945. 45. So I so GATT, what is this? So it's an international agreement superseded by the WTO World Trade Organization in the year of 1994 that minimized the barriers to international trade by eliminating or reducing the quotas, tariffs and subsidies. So next one of the The economy survey report that is, sorry, it's a 2019 recommends that uh, the uh, psychological st uh, studies shall be used in a result of tax compliance which is in favor of using the religious norms that is dig debt is a seed to enhance the tax compliance find the related dimensions of a business environment well first political environment second legal environment third it's a economic environment Fourth one is the technological environment. Fifth one is that is the social environment. So select the right options from the following as given below. A. Second, fourth only. B. is the first, second, fourth only. C. is the first, second, third. And fourth only. D. is the all the above. Friends. So A is the right option for this MCQ. So this is related to that is the legal environment. And the fourth one is that is the technological environment. So friends, so A is the right option for this MCQ. So kindly uh, you read that, that is it's a 2019. So next one of the thing, Consumer Protection Act of 2019 provides the following for what? A first, it's a consumer mediation cell is attached to each of the district's commission and the state commission. Second, consumer disputes redressal commissions at the national level only. Third one, the Central Consumer Protection Council at the national, state and district level. Fourth one, it's the Central Consumer Protection Authority, Matlab CCPA. Select the right options from the following as given below. Whether A, uh, first, second, third only. B, it's the first, second, fourth only. C, it's the first, third, fourth only, D, it's the all the above friends. So C is the right option for this MCQ. So Consumer Protection Act of 2019 provides a what? So first, kya hai? this one, then this one, then this one, except second. So next one I'm looking at. Which are the consumer rights as mentioned in the Consumer Protection Act 1986? So friends, you, you have to remember. First one, right to safety. Second, right to information. Next, right to choose. Then, right to be heard. Next, right to credit purchase. Next, right to seek redressal. Last, 
मतलब सेवेन्थ वन राइट टू कंज्यूमर एजुकेशन द द राइट ऑप्शन सिलेक्ट द राइट ऑप्शन फ्रॉम द पॉलिंग्स आज गिवेन सो ए इट्स ए फर्स्ट सेकंड थर्ड फोर्थ फिफ्थ ओनली बी इट्स द फर्स्ट सेकंड थर्ड फोर्थ फिफ्थ एंड सिक्स्थ ओनली सी इट्स द फर्स्ट सेकंड थर्ड फोर्थ फिफ्थ एंड सिक्स्थ ओनली डी इट्स ए ऑल द अबव फ्रेंड्स सो बी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एमसीक्यू मतलब सो हियर एक्सेप्ट मतलब राइट टू क्रेडिट परचेज इज नॉट द राइट्स मेंशन इन होया सो दिस विल नॉट बी एज इन द कंज्यूमर प्रोटेक्शन एक्ट सो नेक्स्ट वन फेमा फेमा स्टैंड फॉर फ्रेंड्स सो इट्स अ फॉरेन एक्सचेंज मैनेजमेंट एक्ट्स इट्स सी नाइनटीन हैज बीन डिवाइडेड इनटू हाउ मेनी चैप्टर्स एंड सेक्शंस वेदर ए इट्स अ सेवेन नाइनटीन बी इट्स अ सेवेन ट्वेंटी नाइन सी इट्स द सेवेन थर्टी नाइन डी इट्स सी द सेवेन फोर्टी नाइन फ्रेंड्स सो डी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एम मतलब फेमा Nineteen ninety-nine has been divided into seven chapters and forty-nine sections. So here, FEMA Act re regarding uh, FEMA Act, an act to consolidate and amend the law relating to foreign exchange with the objective of uh, facilitating external trade and payments and for promoting the orderly development and maintenance of a foreign exchange. market in india it's a, that is the objectives of a fema act 1999 i have friends some dekhenge fema foreign exchange management act was enacted to replace the foreign exchange regulation act matlab matlab that is the fera so fera the act was what is this it's a 1973 but it was replaced by fema in which year whether 1990 b it's the 1999 c it's a 2000 d it's a 2005 friends so so it was or fera was replaced in the year 1999 by fema so b is the right option for this mcq so next one we dekhenge american quotation means to in foreign exchange market what Quotation in which the value of foreign currency is expressed as per the U.S. dollar. B. It's the quotation in which the value of U.S. dollar is expressed per unit of foreign currency. C. It's the quotation made by New York, uh, New York foreign exchange market. D. It's the quotation made by U.S. based market. So friends, so it's the B is the right option for this MCQ. मतलब quotation in which the value of US dollar is expressed per unit of foreign currency. So B is the right option for this MCQ. So आइए हम देखेंगे CSR friends. It stands for Corporate Social Responsibility. It's the continuing commitment by business part to behave in it uh, ethically and contribute substantially towards. First, rendering, sponsoring, and donation towards social and charitable activities. Second, gender diversity, maximization of profit, and market controlling. Third, it's a maintaining the ecological balances and protection of environment. Next, education, literacy, and public health. Next, political awareness, social inclusion, and social security. Last, model of sixth one, it's a sustainability practices and philanthropy. So select the right options from the following as given below: A, first, second, third, and fourth only. B, it's the first, second, third, fourth, and fifth only. C, it's the first, second, fourth, uh, fourth, and sixth only. D, it's all the above. Right? So C is the right option. Model of A will be then. थर्ड होगा देन फोर्थ होगा देन सिक्स होगा मतलब सेकेंड नहीं होगा फिफ्थ भी नहीं होगा सो फ्रेंड्स सो सी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एम सी क्यू आइए फ्रेंड्स हम चर्चा करेंगे वट इज द मनी ऑफ सी एस आर इज अ स्ट्रेटेजी अंडरटेकन स्ट्रेटेजी अंडरटेकन बाई कंपनीज नॉट टू जस्ट ग्रो प्रॉफिट्स बट ऑल्सो टू टेक एन एक्टिव एंड पॉजिटिव सोशल रोल in the world around them it's the meaning of a csr so next one which are the drivers of globalization from the following so first population mobility 
special labor, second is the exporting, third one is the financial flows, uh, next the potential untapped markets, next cultural transformation, next one is the changing the political situation, seventh one is the economic integration. So select the right options from the following as given below. A. All the above except 4. B. It's all the above except 3. C. It's all the above except 2. And D. It's all the above. Friends. So C is the right option for this MCQ. The drivers of a globalization except 2. Matlab, ye nahi hoga, uh, ye hoga, ye bhi hoga, ye bhi hoga, ye bhi hoga, ye bhi hoga. A B Hoga except two. So friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. Uh, so next one, what are the most common modes of entry uh, strategies into foreign market or international business? Exporting, then piggybacking, then uh, counter trade, then licensing, then joint venture, company ownership, franchising, outsourcing, then greenfield projects, then turnkey projects. Select the right option from the following as given below. A. All the above except second. B. It's all the above except third. C. It's all the above except eighth one. D. It's all the above. Friends, so D is the right option for this MCQ. Matlab, A. Sab hai. Kya hai? Common more to make an entry into international market or I mean the foreign market. So next one of the I have match karege, match theories of international trade, the list one with the list two. So list A me kya kya hai, it's a factory endowment theory, B is the mercantile theory, C is the national competitive advantage theory, D is the theory of absolute cost advantages. So list two, Adam Smith, Michael Potter, then Ellie, Hexcars. They say David Ho. So select the right options from the following as given below. A1, B2, C3, D4, B, it's A4, uh, B3, C2, D1, C. It's the D A3, B4, C2, D1, D, it's A4, B3, C2, D1. Friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. A3, then B, 4, then C, 2, then 4, Matlab. so D, 1. So it's a, the matching between, that is the least 1 and the least 2. Matlab. So, so they have coined this theory so far as the international trade is concerned. So friends, so C is the right option for this MCU. So next one of the consider the accession uh, and the region as given below. A. International trade along the lines of a comparative advantages enhance the allocative of existing resources. So friends, typing error is the resources. Then R. International trade is the growth engine. A. A, uh, A is right only. B. R is right only. C. Both A and R are right. And R is the right explanation of A. D is both A and R are right and R is not the right explanation of A. Friends, so D is the right option for this MCQ. So R matlab the region is not the correct explanation to A. So D is the right option for this MCQ. So next one we have a situation of international price discrimination where the price of a product when sold in an importing country is less than the price of that product in the market of an exporting country. It is known as from kya bolenge, whether A is the monopoly, B is the discount pricing policy, C is the dumping, D is the propagating. So friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ, vital MCQ. Friends, you have to remember. So next one on the KG, which trade, uh, dash trade theory or concert trade theory says that a country which initially develops and exports the new product that may eventually become an importer of it and may no longer to manufacture or to produce the product. 
इन कोर्ट्स ऑफ थ्योरी में वदर इट्स अ थ्योरी ऑफ एब्सोल्यूट कॉस्ट एडवांटेजेस बेस्ड द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ लाइफ साइकल थ्योरी से इट्स द फैक्टर इट ऑफ एंड थ्योरी डी इट्स द मार्केटलिज्म थ्योरी फ्रेंड्स सो बी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एमसीक्यू बी सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे व्हिच आर नॉट द नॉन टैरिफ ट्रेड बैरियर्स नॉन टैरिफ बैरियर्स ए डी पी ए और मतलब फर्स्ट वॉलेंटरी एक्सपोर्ट रेस्ट्रिक्शन नेक्स्ट वन लोकल कंटेंट रिक्वायरमेंट थर्ड इज एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव बैरियर नेक्स्ट वन इज तारीफ रेट कोटैच लास्ट वन मतलब फिफ्थ वन इज द ट्रेडिशनल इम्पोर्ट तारीफ सो सिलेक्ट द करेक्ट ऑप्शन फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग्स ए फर्स्ट एंड सेकेंड ओनली बी इट्स द सेकेंड एंड थर्ड ओनली सी इट्स ए दैट इज द फोर्थ एंड फिफ्थ ओनली डी इट्स ऑल द अब एक्सेप्ट टू फ्रेंड सो सी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एम सी क्यू मतलब द फोर्थ वन एंड द ट्रेडिशनल इम्पोर्ट मतलब द फिफ्थ वन सो दे आर नॉट द नॉन टैरिफ बैरियर्स सो फर्स्ट सेकेंड थर्ड आर द नॉन टैरिफ बैरियर्स सो फ्रेंड सो सी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एम सी यूज नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे कंसिडर बोर्ड द एसेसन एंड द रिजन ए Producers have now flexible manufacturing system. R. It's a agricultural and industrial manufacturing trends are the economic dimensions of the environment which affect the B. E. Business environment. A. It's both A and R are correct, but R is the correct explanation of A. B. It's both A and R are correct, but R is not the correct explanation of A. C it's A is correct while R is not correct D it's A is not correct while R is correct so friends so B is the right option for this MC Q so next one we will take which is the main difference between a tariff and a quota A a quota is not harmful to domestic consumers B a tariff is not harmful to the foreign producers c a quota decreases the quantity of imports more than tariff d it is a tariff yields government revenue while quota uh, while a quota unless it is sold does not so friends so d is the right option for this mc q so next one we will see government procurement regulation or law constitute a non tariff barrier when कौन सा सिचुएशन में ए गवर्नमेंट सोच ए प्रिफरेंस फॉर डोमेस्टिक सेलर्स ओवर फॉरेन सेलर्स बी इट्स गवर्नमेंट नीड्स दैट गुड्स बाय व्हिच इट परचेजेस टू मीट ए यूनिफॉर्म सेफ्टी स्टैंडर्ड्स सी इट्स अ गवर्नमेंट एजेंसीज आर रिक्वायर्ड टू बाय फ्रॉम लोएस्ट बिडर D is a government owned undertaking do not make a, a profit or a, on inputs that they buy at home or abroad so friends so here D is the right option for this MC Q so next one hum dekhenge kaun sa or dash has been the impact in the trade related aspects on that is the intellectual property rights of on india A it's increasing the demand for cheaper technology and medicines B it's the FDI in fertilizers and food grain productions C it's the higher cost of drugs and foreign owned technology D it's all the above friends so C is the right option for this MC Q C So next one hum dekhenge which are covered the trade related uh, trade related so you see typing error trade related intellectual property rights that is the trips under wto whether a trade secrets patents copyrights fourth one is industrial design so select the right option from the following as given below a is all the above except one b is all the above except second c is all the above except four D you see all the above friends so D is the right option for this MCQ. मतलब trade secrets, 
patents, copyrights, industrial designs are covered on the trips, on the WTO rules and the regulations of the system. So next one we will see, the balance of export and import of goods is called kya hai, hum kya bol lege usko, whether balance of trade beats the current account, sits the capital account, D gets the current account deficit. So friends, so A is the right option for this MCQ. The balance of exports and imports of goods is called kya hai, balance of trade. So next one, hum dekhenge, matching karenge, consider both the list one and list two and match with each other. List A me kya kya hai, balance of payments, then balance of trade, then current account, D is the capital account. So by term. So these are the common question. You will find. So list two me kya kya hai, value of exports and imports of a country, then second, all the economic transaction between a country's residents and the residents of the other countries. Third one, transaction leading to changes in the financial assets and uh, liabilities of a country. Fourth one, you would say, imports and export of uh, goods and uh, services and unilateral transfer of uh, goods and uh, services. Select the right options from the following as given below. A, A1, B2, C3, D4, B, it's A2, B1, C3, D4, C, it's A2, B1, C4, D3, D, it's A4, B3, C2, D1. So friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. A, Matlab, second, then B1, then C, then D3. The bar may repeat Gautam. So balance of uh, uh, payments is related to all the economic transactions between the countries, residents and the residents of uh, other countries. It's uh, known as balance of uh, payments. Then the balance of trade is uh, related to that is the value of uh, import and uh, uh, exports and imports of a country. Then current account is related to imports and exports of goods and services and unilateral transfer of goods and services. Capital account is related to transactions leading to changes in the financial assets and liabilities of a country. Vital MCQ. So friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. Next one of the improvement uh, in the balance of payments. That is the BOP in the short form we can say. Uh, Deficits shall be possible through devaluation, then deflationary financial policies, then foreign exchange control, then export promotion, then import control. Select the right options from the following as given below. A. All the above except first. All the above except second. C. It's all the above except third. D. It's all the above. Friends. So, D is the right option. So, Matala, first, second, third, fourth, fifth, uh, fourth and fifth are uh, helpful to improve the balance of payments, the deficit to decrease. So, next one of the thing, as for the government agreement of WTO, what are the terms of a blue box, green box, AM, Matala, that is the upper box. So, what are the taxes, then bonus, then subsidies, then, sorry, interest. So, friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. As for the agreement of WTO, so subsidies are the terms of a blue box, green box, and AMC. So, C is the right option for this MCQ. So, next one of the thing, yeah, extension of domestic marketing mix into international markets is known as called as kya hai. Whether international marketing mix, B, it's an international marketing strategy, C, it's the geocentric approach, D, it's the ethnocentric approach. So, friends, so D is the right option for this MCQ. Hum usko kya ho leke? It's the ethnocentric approach. So, D is the right option for this MCQ. So, next one, which one is a disadvantages of international business? 
Whether A is a dumping, U is the fiscal deficit, C is the white market, D is the sale of a surplus goods. So, friends, so A is the right option. Matla, so, dumping is a, a disadvantage of an international business. So, next one of the gang, which are the components of globalization? First, free trade of goods and services. Next, free movement of labor. Next, it's a free movement of capital. Next, that is the FDI. Foreign direct investment. Next, that is the diffusion of technology. Uh, last one, Matla, sixth one, it's the foreign investment policy. Select the correct options as given below. A. All the above except. Second, B. It's all the above except third. C. It's all the above except four. D. It's all the above. Friends, so D is the right option for this MCO. Matla, so these are all the components of a globalization. So next one of the the trade agreement which is which has a requirement to import as a condition to export it's known as kya hai whether foreign trade b it's the free trade c it's the counter trade d it's the cross border trade so friends so c is the right option for this mcq so next one United Nations Conference on Trade and Development, it's a UNCTAD, mainly wants to promote the development of uh, which nations, whether A is the underdeveloped nations, B is the developing nations, C is the developed nations, T is the all the above friends. B is the right option for this MCQ. So UNCTAD mainly wants to promote the development of uh, developing nation. So, B is the right option for this MCQ. Next one, which one is the basis of international trade as for the product life cycle theory of international trade or business? A. Product planning and development policy. B. Is the product planning and distribution strategy. C. Is the technological gap among the different nations. D. Is the gap in the factor in the means. Friends, so C is the right option for this MCQ. Technological gap among the different nations is the basis of international trade as for the product life cycle theory on international trade or a business. So next one on the hang the national competitive advantages theory of international trade has been given by who? Whether A. Michael Potter, B. The David Ricardo, C. It's A. The Philip Kotler, D. It's A. The Adam Smith. Friends, so A is the right option for this MCQA. So, next one on the case, the barriers which do not directly increase the price of imported goods but otherwise make the restriction in foreign trade, it's regarded as a what? Whether it's the goods and the service tax, B is the tariff trades, C is the that is the non tariff barrier, D it's a, the excise duty. No doubt, friends. So it's a, C, a, C will be the right option. So, uh, friends, so tariffs. So here are the tariff barriers. So tariffs are the monetary barriers in the form of tax, taxes imposed on imported or exported goods. Non tariff barriers, yeah, hey, non tariff barriers are in compasses a diverse range of non-monetary measures. So, I from the KK, what is the meaning of a non-tariff barrier? Any measure other than the tariff used by country to restrict the international trade. It's a non-tariff barrier. So, next one of the KK, the headquarter of a U.S. city at EG located in Hoya, whether it's Washington, B is the Geneva, C is the Moscow, D is the London. No doubt, friends, B is the right option for this MCQ. U.S. city at is located Geneva. So, next one, MCQ of the KK, what are the methods of a protection in international trade? The methods of protection, tariff barriers, Next, non tariff barriers, next, subsidies, then quotas. Fifth one is currency manipulation. Select the right options as given below. A. All the above except third. B. It's all the above except four. C. It's all the above except five. 
डिवेड सी ऑल द एबव फ्रेंड्स सो डी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एमसीक्यू मतलब सो दी इज आर ऑल द मेथड्स ऑफ प्रोटेक्शन इन इंटरनेशनल ट्रेड सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे व्हिच कैन बी द कॉजेस ऑफ डिस इक्विलिब्रियम इन बैलेंस ऑफ पेमेंट्स whether a it's a excessive overseas investment second it's the less export third one it's the excessive export so select the correct options as given below a only a b it's a one and two only c it's the second and the third only d it's a all the friends so d is the right option for this mc q matlab these three are the causes of the this equilibrium in balance of payments so next one hum dekhenge the where are the headquarter of wto or wto is located in where whether a it is geneva b it is washington c it is beijing d it is the london no doubt friends so a is the right option for this mc q so next one hum dekhenge Which one is not included in balance of payments on capital account? A. Its export of goods. B. Its the grant. C. Its the foreign investment. D. Its the external loans and advances. So friends, so A is the right option for this MCQ. I am friends. Dubara ham chacha karenge. What is the meaning of a BOP? मतलब balance of payment. Balance of international payments is a systematic and summary record of a country's economic and financial transaction with the rest of the world over a period of time, maybe it quarterly or half yearly or yearly. It's the meaning of a BOP, balance of payments. So I am taking a BOP. It's a record of all international financial transaction made by. A residents of a country. So main category of a BOP, what category of a balance of payment, current account is there, capital account is there, financial account account is there. So capital account, what capital account modifies the flow of a funds from goods and services trade. It says that is the import and export between countries and includes the money receives or spent on manufacturing or goods manufactured or Producing the goods and the raw materials. So it's a so these are coming under the current account. I a capital account. Capital account monitor the flow of international capital transaction and includes what the money received from debt forgiveness and the gift taxes. Come to the financial account. So financial account monitors the flow of funds pertaining to investments in businesses, real estate. And stock, and also includes the government owned assets that is the gold and SDR held a with IFM SDR friends. So it's a special drawing rights. So next one, we will see which one is not covered under the WTO. Whether it's the GATT, huh? That is General Agreement on Trade in Services, based custom unit, C is Treaty. T trips D is that is the it's a trade related aspects of intellectual property rights. T T R I trips. So friends, so here, so D, B is not the right option for this M C Q. And and both the gas trips trips are covered under the W T O. So next one labor L I B O R stands for kya hai? Whether A is the uh so no doubt friends so it's a this will be the that is the london interbank offer rate so c is the right option for this mcq friends i am chacha karenge what is the uh, matlab kya hai libor ka so libor is the global reference rate for unsecured short term borrowing in the interbank market and acts as a benchmark for short term interest rate so libor is used For pricing of interest rate, that is the swap currency rate, swaps as well as the mortgage. So, it's the swap stands for this and the uses of a LIBOR. So next one, we will see which currency has been designated as a globally the acceptable currency by IMF. Or the IMF 
फ्रेंड्स सो इंटरनेशनल मनी लेंडिंग फंड ए जापानीज येन डीएस यूएस डॉलर सीएस यूरोपियन यूरो डीएस ऑल द अबव फ्रेंड्स सो डी इज द राइट ऑप्शन फॉर दिस एमसीक्यू सो नेक्स्ट वन हम देखेंगे हाउ मेनी नेशंस आर द मेंबर्स ऑफ वर्ल्ड बैंक आज ऑन 1 अप्रैल 2021 वदर 179 country nations, be it 189 nations or country, see it's 199, be it 209, friends. So, B is the right option for this MCQ. So, 199 nations are the members of World Bank as on 1st April 2021. So, next one of the thing, which are the subsidiaries of World Bank? First one, kya hai? it's IBRD. So, B, second, it's the IDA, International Development Association. Third one, it's International Finance Corporation, IFC. Then, it's MIGA, it's the Multilateral Investment Guarantee Agency. And last one, it's that is the International Center for Settlement of Investment Disputes, Matlab, ICSID. So, from the semester exemption point of view, so these soft problems are very very vital so select the correct options as given below a all the above except second b it's all the above except three all the above except four d it's all the above friends so d is the right option for this mcq matlab ibrd ida iefc mega icsid so these are the subsidiaries of what they so next one, foreign capital includes kya hai? Oh, what? Whether foreign commercial borrowings, B is the foreign aid, C is the foreign in, uh, investments, D is all of this, or all the above, friends. So D is the right option for this MCQ. Uh, foreign commercial borrowings, foreign aids, foreign investments are included in Hoya in foreign capital category. So next one. NAFTA, it stands for North American Free Trade Agreement, was established. A free trade zone in North America and the agreement came into force in which year? Whether it's 1st January 1994, B it's 1st January 1994, C it's 1st April 1994, D it's 1st July 1994. Friends, so A is the right option for this MCQ. Matlab, uh, NAPTA came into force in 1st January 1994. So, A is the right option for this MCU. Next one, we will see which are the objectives of EU, Matlab, European Union. So, its establishment here is that is 1993 and how many member countries are the nations under AU27. Objectives to establish the economic and monetary union. Second, to implement a common foreign and defense, defense policy. Third, to develop the relations in the sphere of home affairs and justice. Fourth one, to promote the peace, values and well-being of all the members of AU. Select the right options as given below. A. All the above except first. B. It's all the above except second. Third. It's all the above except third. D. It's all the above. Friends, so these are the Objectives of a U among the nations of a U. Next one, I'm looking at which is the objectives of association, not long as said. So, its establishment year is 1967. So, in Jakarta, Indonesia, it was a um, founded, and there are how many countries? 10 member countries of ASEAN. So, it's a association of a South East Asian nation. So, kya hai? Objectives. A. To promote the trade and investment. Second, to maintain the financial market stability in the region. Third, is to promote the sustainable tourism and people to people connectivity. Fourth, to enhance the cooperation in food, agriculture and forestry. Select the right options as given below a all the above except first b it's all the above except second c it's all the above except third d it's all the above friends so d is the right option for this mcq matlab so these are the main objectives of a asset so it's the so southeast so it's a southeast 
assets. So these are the objectives. So it's a last but not the least uh, the white MCQ that is the SAR. It stands for friends. So South Asian Association for Regional Cooperation has been established in which year and, and how many member countries? Whether it's a 1985 and 7, B it's the 1985 at 8, C it's the 1987 and 7, D it's the 1987 and 8. So sorry, it's a uh, sorry. Uh, no, it's okay. So B is the right option for this MCQ. So, sir, it was established in the year of uh, 1985. And uh, how many member countries in SAR? So, eight. Who are the member countries of uh, SAR? So, uh, Afghanistan, Bangladesh, Bhutan, India, Maldives, Nepal, Pakistan, and Sri Lanka. There are how many countries? The eight countries and its establishment is it's a 1985. So friends, so these are all about the vital 75 MCQs from the business environment and the international business. So friends, I'm hopeful that you have learned a lot. So during the discussion, if any mismatch or gap you will find, kindly you give your below comment and suggestion in the comment section. So if you have not subscribed my channel, kindly you uh, subscribe it. Uh, if you like this video lecture, kindly share it and forward it. So, thanks a million to all of you.